Did you tore both hamstrings at different points? Or you uh, both hamstrings? So all year was really my left. And then uh, before I ended up coming back, my right one ended up giving out on me. Um, so the frustration level, I mean, you think you're close, you're close, and then you're not. What's this year been? Uh, like I said, it's been tough. Um, because I was actually, I was good, I think, going into week three of the season. Being good, ready to come back and play. Yeah, and they wanted me to uh, kind of build it up since I kind of missed training coming and everything. So that's what I've been doing uh, every week throughout the year. And um, felt really good, was building building up, running and stuff before practice and everything. Practicing before practice, technically. And like I said, before I got to, before we were about to go to Germany, uh, I had another like running session uh, that Sunday morning, uh, and yeah, my right one ended up giving out, and then I kind of, kind of settled back, and then I went to see a specialist to see, you know, what was going on, and then I ended up getting some good information out of it, and kind of taking it a step at a time after that. So. When do you anticipate, I guess, being fully cleared to go, or is that still a process you're going through right now, like OTAs, uh, spring or whatever? Yeah, I should be good by then. Uh, I done, Passed uh, a couple of my earlier tests already last week, so I started like field work and everything like that now. So about two or three weeks later, that should be good. That's we, good to go. We've talked about how you hadn't had a hamstring injury before. I don't think. Um, how difficult is that to deal with? Where they, they pretty much tell you like don't do anything, but you're trying to well, you're wired to try and work through things. Uh, it's very difficult, honestly, because uh, at first I didn't know what I can do, what not to do, how much intensity I should put in, different exercise, how much I shouldn't, you know, relax. Uh, and like with me, it's kind of new feelings every time I do something. Uh, Cause uh, the way my injury was, it just kept getting worse and worse every time. So I, I had to, you know, kind of back off and then I would feel good again. And kind of, okay. And they put me through tests, I'll do really good. And then it just come back, like something will happen and set back again. And it's kind of like a repeating factor over time. So. Um, you know, it was kind of, well, with them, they laugh, they kind of laughed about it because it was like, this is kind of unusual, which uh, after I sent, went and seen a specialist uh, and the way my body is and the way, like, I, you know, like the way I use my body and everything like that, um, they pretty much was like, yeah, you kind of, you know, your injury is kind of uncommon because of the way you do things and how you, you know, my long lever body is and everything like that, so kind of had to break everything down and restructure it and kind of uh, start like level one again and build everything back up. What, is it, is it, was it a lost season then? I mean, what do you, what do you take take away from the season going forward? Uh, I don't, I wouldn't consider it being a lost season because, you know, I'm around my brother and kind of like mentally, you know, I stayed in it mentally because like I said, it's a, it's a new system technically. So I still wanted to be able to, if I was able to come back which during the year it was a good chance, so I kind of stayed heavy, like, involved, and uh, and I kind of just went about it that way. So I wouldn't necessarily say it was a lost season physically, probably, but mentally, uh, I was there the whole time. Hunger next year, going into next year, hunger has got to be immense. Oh, that's that's not even a question. Uh, <laughs> I, man, like I say, I, I got so much balled up in me right now that uh, I can't wait to like you know just show it, or, you know. Get it going, honestly. What's the excitement was, level thinking about fitting into Shane's offense, playing with Anthony Richardson? Just some of the things you got to see them do this year. It's, it's, I can't tell you how much I'm just, you know, even talking to my parents or talking to more of them, like, man, like, I wish I was out there so bad with y'all. Like, I just know how much fun it is going to be. And that's made it worse throughout the year because I'm just like, man, like, if, I, if I was able to do this or if I was able to, you know, get in this, it's just, uh, you know, it just makes you like anxious and then you just like, ah, oh, but I can't do anything. And then you break, like, it just, you know, it keeps going high and low, high and low throughout the season. So um, I just know it's going to be very exciting and I can't wait because I, I, got, I got a big point to prove and a big you know, statement to make.